Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be testing out iris scanning and showing you just why Samsung ditched it. This is my Samsung Galaxy Note 9, which is, as far as I'm concerned, the last Samsung device to have iris scanning. I just received this today, I bought it off of eBay, and I've really been enjoying the phone. I've been using the fingerprint scanner on the back to unlock it though. But back when I had my Galaxy S8 back in 2017, I always used iris scanning. So I'm going to test it out. So I did manage to register my iris data into the phone. So I'm going to remove this and try to register it again because it was very hard. So I'm just going to try to register them. That was much quicker than it was last time. So I'm going to do irises or fingerprint and we're going to see how accurate this is. So you really need to angle the phone up, which I guess having the fingerprint scanner there as a second option is very nice, but I really will use the irises as a second option because of how unreliable they are. They're good in some cases, like for example, if my hands are wet. Now I'm gonna try face recognition. So I'm gonna remove the face data, register face. That was pretty easy. So I'm gonna do Intel yeah, I'm going to do intelligence scan since that was one of the big features with this phone and the S9. Uh, yes, I unlock screen. Okay. I'm going to try some of these features in a second. Definitely slower than fingerprint. I'm going to give you a good example on fingerprint scanner speed real quick. That's pretty fast. Not as fast as my old Moto X4, but pretty fast still. So... I'm going to try this with my eyes closed, because it says something about require eyes. So... Wow, so it just works with my eyes closed. That's surprising. Okay, so I'm going to try the require open eyes feature. And... Let's see if this works. So I just locked it. Is this got some like auto lock thing on wow okay okay require open eyes barely did anything there yeah so I, I had my eyes closed i'm gonna try it again yeah so um closing my eyes opening oh see so, yeah, it's like Yes, that's really weird. I don't know why that feature doesn't work, but... Um, so this feature, the iris scanning feature, was announced with the Note 7. So technically this probably was the last Samsung phone with iris scanning. Yeah, that's just surprising. That's why they moved on. Probably because security and speed. So thank you, and goodbye.